everyone, so you're probably wondering why your girl looks like a complete disaster. Um, it's because I'm not wearing any makeup. I wanted to do the dollar store makeup challenge to see if, you know, the dollar store can make your girl look good or not. So we'll find out. Currently, I'm like breaking out because if I touch my skin, I'll break out. Putting dollar makeup on my face is going to make me break out in an instant, but you know what? I want to, like, I've always wanted to try this, so I really want to see, like, if any of this stuff works or not, but who knows, let's try. So the first thing I'm going to do is this foundation. This is all they had, so, so I'm going to use my fingers for this, so let's see how this works. All right, so let's, oh no, it feels like sunscreen. Oh no, do you see that? Oh my god, maybe my fingers are making everything worse. Your girl gets three pimples and freaks out. I'm about to get a face full of pimples. Oh no. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> mm, okay, well. <laughs> 10 out of 10 would not recommend. Honestly, like. Putting dollar makeup on your face isn't probably the best idea when your skin is super sensitive, so I think this is as good as this makeup's gonna get. So I bought concealer. I think it's darker than the foundation, so that's even better. It's, it's darker. It's much darker than the actual foundation. I don't know if you can see this or not, but... Um, feels just like the other stuff in a different tube. Let's cover some of the pimps I got going on right now. What happens when you touch your face, Alyssa? You break out. Oh, it burns for some reason. Doesn't, like, when it's burning, it means it's working. Like, it's, it's making me prettier, duh. It's fine. We look good. I feel like blending it with my finger is just smearing it off. It looks so bad, like it's just, it's as good as it's gonna get blended. I'm not using a beauty blender, I'm not gonna use my actual beauty blender, that's cheating, no thanks. So next I got some powder, because I knew this was not going to look good at all for some reason, but I was trying to go all out, so I got the liquid foundation. I'm gonna put this powder on my face, see how this works. <laughs> This is what it comes with. This isn't a sponge. This is paper. This, they gave you a piece of paper. So, I'm just gonna use this. I feel like this stuff works better than the foundation like honestly just skip foundation no one's gonna buy dollar makeup but if you were to don't use that foundation it's gross <sighs> i mean it doesn't look disgusting like what is this i don't know if you guys can see this or not but like right here right here and right here the makeup's really dark Like, those are random places for it to just stay dark. I'm gonna let it ride. It's fine. So the next thing I have is eyebrows because it looks like I don't have any, but in real life I have like more than what you see, but whatever. So for eyebrows, I bought this pencil and this brow powder set in dark brown and medium brown. Um, yeah. Oh no, honey, Jesus Christ. Oh. oh no. This stuff is serious. There's no control over this stuff. Oh snap. That is so serious. I don't know how to fix this. Like, I'm trying the best I can to just create some sort of like good looking eyebrow <laughs> and it's just not working like oh my god 
This is the worst product I have ever put on my face. That foundation was honestly nothing compared to this. <laughs> I have one black eyebrow and one like okay eyebrow. I'm gonna get that powder again. We're just gonna put it over my eyebrow. Maybe it'll disappear forever. It's a dollar, like it should just go. All right, so I'm going to try this brow powder and see if it can help me. So there's two colors in here and I'm gonna use the darkest one because my eyebrows are like black now. So honestly, there's no helping them. This brush. It's disgusting. Um, well, you see, I think this is making everything worse. These eyebrows are cousins. They are not even sisters. They are definitely not twins. So the bronzer I have is by LA Colors. Everything in here is by like LA Colors pretty much because that's all they have. Uh, it's this big. And it's sparkly. I hate sparkle face makeup, so this is gonna be atrocious. For the bronzer, I also bought a makeup brush because this is the only makeup brush they had. That's why I'm using my fingers. So this is the Wet n Wild contour brush. So let's see how cute this will make me. Oh, this is just pure sparkles. Like, I would put this on my eyes. Mm. Mm. Okay, on my camera it looks very prominent. Mm. Okay, now I just look like a clown. This is not what I was trying to do. Like, I was actually, like, trying to do my makeup and hopefully liked any of this stuff. This is really as blended as it's going to get, so goodbye. So next is blush, and it's by LA Colors, and it looks the exact same, it's just a pink color. I'm gonna use the cute little brush that comes with it because I already used the contour brush, so mm, smile. better. Ow, this brush hurts. Mm, suffered through the pain. Oh god, if I wanted to do my makeup with a porcupine, holy crap. Um, this stuff is super, super pigmented, so mm, I look like a clown even more. You know, I had high hopes for the dollar store. Why would the dollar store have shitty makeup? Like, why? Like, I feel like it should be, like, at Sephora. <laughs> so, the next thing I'm going to do is eyeshadow. Oh no. R.I.P. I'm gonna use this because this is what it comes with and I didn't buy brushes and I don't want to cheat. So I'm gonna go with the little light color. Look at me being a beauty guru. Damn, Melissa. Okay. Mm, I'm just gonna put that on my eyes. This is what I do in real life. So if people think I look half decent, Okay, all right. I like this color. This color's pretty. So we're, we're just gonna use this, whatever. I don't know where I'm gonna put it because I don't know how to do makeup. Um, we're just gonna put it somewhere. Eee. This thing sucks. I used to use these in high school somehow and they're just terrible. I should really do my makeup how I did in high school and just react to how ugly I used to be. How ugly I still am, but like, goddamn. All right, I'm done with eyeshadow. I don't really care. So the next thing I have would be eyeliner. And this is probably going to get in my eyes, but you know what, it's fine. It'll look, it'll look good. Like I swear, I promise you, like it'll look fine. Mm. Well. Oh. Honestly, like this doesn't look terrible. Um. It's like real out there, but you know, it's fine. It's what it was doing it on its own, so I'm not gonna fight it. I don't hate it, but it's not like dry. Like it's still very wet on my eyes. 
it's fine. So the next thing I got was mascara, and I actually got Wet n Wild mascara for a dollar at the dollar store. This is like the Mega Wear stuff. Oh, all right, we'll put a little bit of this on. My eyelashes are not the greatest, but when I have actual like mascara on, my eyelashes can look pretty good and pretty long. Right now, they look non-existent. So the next thing I got was eyelashes. They don't come with lash glue, so I'm just using my own that I have. Because they didn't have any lash glue at the dollar store. Like, were they expecting me to, like, use my spit and, like, put them on my eyes? Like, what? So I have my own lash glue, which is Duo. I will see you after I put these lashes on. I just put my eyelashes on. I'm glad I didn't record me putting these on because I just walked around for 20 minutes trying to find this eyelash and I realized it was attached to my hair. Classic. The last thing I have is some lip product and it's a little stick thing. Ooh, you could twist it. Girl, this is high tech. This feels like I'm just rubbing oil on my lips. Huh, interesting. This is beautiful. This looks good. This is what a dollar can get you ladies. Oh my god, these eyelashes hurt. So the last thing I got was I tried to buy an outfit from the dollar store, but they didn't have anything. So I'm going to show you the closest I can get to an outfit. So yeah, this is the only thing they had for clothes. And I was trying to get like some cool pants and stuff, but... They didn't have none of that, so this is all I can give you. If you want to get this look, go to the Dollar Tree because this is what they have. And I know this is different, I'm not telling a story, but I wanted to do a challenge because they're all old, like this is probably a year old, but I'm not relevant so it doesn't matter if I'm not with the trends. I want to do more challenge videos because they're fun, like why not? You don't want to hear about my boring life. You probably don't want to see this either. But I wanted to do this, so I did it for myself, so oh well. Give this video a like, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next Sunday.